Now, Eddie, a 3 2 victory today against Head and Rangers in the uh, East Riding Senior Cup final. Uh, we're uh, champions, how does that feel? It feels good, but I'd like to start by congratulating Head, to be honest, because I thought, you know, from the outset, they pressed. They, they, they had a, a game plan which they kept to and I thought you know they, they gave us a really 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 good game and if I was them to be honest I'd be a little bit annoyed that they didn't win. So yeah it feels great, it feels great to win obviously. Um, Ali took his goal at the end there fantastically you know to win and there was I think seconds left you know. Um, so yeah it feels good and the boys are happy that they've won. Uh, in terms of the start to the game I thought it was quite even maybe head and just edging it possibly. Do you think that concerned you, or was it more that they were playing? The opposition were really good. I, I think they would. I'll be honest with you. I thought they were decent. I thought I thought they were decent right up until the point of finishing. You know, both teams in that first half lacked quality, and the only bit of quality in that, really, in that whole half, was Dicko getting the ball out of his feet, crossing the ball, and Dennis Edo. That was probably the only bit of quality that we had. It was. It was. You know, it was poor. I think the crowd was very vocal and, and therefore you know we, we didn't we didn't deal with the crowd very well and I, you know that's part of football but yeah you know I think it was fairly even it didn't it, I've got to be honest it didn't con concern me because I didn't I didn't you know as much as they were getting in behind it I didn't actually see them scoring. Uh, you touched on Denny's goal there just thinking sure just how much we've missed him in the past last few weeks of the season. Yeah I told him at half time you know I told him at half time I said you know that's the reason you know, you know if we'd have had Denny against Tadcaster and, and, and Grantham, it would have been and Silsden, you know, it would have been a completely different, different game. It, we do miss Denny. Denny scores goals. He's always in the right place at the right time, and you know, all like that. It was a bullet header. Nobody was going to stop that. It was a great header. Uh, goal in, like you said, the dying seconds of the game. Do you think that's just sort of a reflection of how our season's gone? Because we've scored a lot late on. Maybe it's because we're fitter. Yeah. Well, maybe they were fitter than last year because, you know, last season we were looking at the stats. Bridge were conceding a lot of goals in the last few minutes. This season we're scoring a lot of goals in the last few minutes, and that's because I think we keep going and we are fitter than than we were last year. And I think we need to be fitter next season to be able to press higher up the pitch and, and, and you know press in the midfield, stop them having having enough time on the ball. But yeah, you know, ninety minutes. You know, well, 92 minutes and 45 seconds, I think it was. But yeah, it was good. You know, I, I, I would always back Ali on someone like that. You know, if Ali gets in behind and it, it's him and the goalkeeper, I back Ali. You know. Yeah, two goals from today. Do you think it's been a good first season for him at the club? Yeah, I do. I, you know, there's things things he, he needs to work on, as, as a lot of players do. But I think, you know, goal scoring, he's done really well. You know, the two goals he scored against, is it North Shields? The yes. score, yeah, I mean, you know, and, and the goal he scored against works off, you know, that, that's balling behind and Ali running at the goalkeeper, I back Ali, I back Ali all the time, you know, so it's been a good season for Ali, yeah. A bit of a depleted squad uh, yet again today, so uh, no Andy Norfolk? Andy Norfolk's had to go um, with, with work, he, you know, he works for Bishop Burn College, so he's had to go with them because they're playing in the national final tomorrow, so that's good, you know, it's good for Andy, and, you know, uh, so yeah, we missed that. Uh, Andy understands the game. Andy understands the game, and we miss Andy on the pitch or even on the sidelines. We miss Andy. So you know, yeah, we missed Andy. Tom Algar and George Harrison have both got a game for York tomorrow. You know, and they're, they're aiming to try and win that under 19s league, having won the cup. So York wouldn't release him for tonight. Totally understand that. Left us with 14 players, two of which are goalkeepers. You know, that's that's life. We, you know, we should have had the quality in that squad. You know, after all, the team that started. Apart from Andy and Denny swapping, the team we played Stocksbridge, you know, and we played them off the park. Uh, just on George and particularly Tom, do you think we uh, maybe missed them today? Um, yeah, I think we do. They give us different options. I'm not saying they would have started because I don't think I would have changed the start in 11 after the Stocksbridge game. I don't think the, the gap of finishing that on the 22nd of whatever and we're playing on the whatever of May. You know, two weeks and a bit has helped. You know, we um, because you know we're, we're certainly not football fresh. We weren't today. 
you know, and that, I don't think that helped. It would have been better to play it for us, not Hedden, but it would have been better for us to play straight after we played that last game, you know, because we'd have still been fresh. And but hey, that's that's football. At the end of the day, we keep smiling because we're one yep. Ben. <laughs> Uh, avoiding relegation and also now winning a trophy, uh, would you call that a successful season? I think it's been a good season for for, for Brid. I think you know that we, we use the term avoided relegation. You know, we, we actually finished what was it, fifteenth or fourteenth or whatever. And you know, yeah, it's, we didn't go down, so yes, we, we avoided relegation. But you know, I think it was a little bit harsh on the boys to say you know we've avoided relegation. It's almost like you know we were third, second bottom and. You know, we had to win, and everybody else above us had to lose. Well, everybody else had to do something, and we didn't. So, I think it's, you know, we stayed in the national, uh, the, the Northern Premier League, and we've won a piece of silverware. So, it has been a good season, yes, mate. Yeah. Uh, Eddie, thanks for your time today. Anytime, mate. Well done this season. Anytime. Cheers. Time for a break. Yeah. Thank you. Stop. Marvellous.